station will go off the air for four minutes during the testing of our alert system. Wasn't he on the plane? Uh, oh, Hazel, why didn't you call and tell me something happened? Uh, Do you realize I kept seven people waiting for him to show up? Uh, uh, well, uh, oh, Hazel, I'm very angry with you. You know how hard I've worked on this deal. Why, after disappointing these people, some of them may change their mind about selling. Oh, why don't you answer me? Where is Mr. Egan? What happened? Oh, uh, I... Uh, I'll get it. Oh, uh, here, this must be for you. Somebody shoved it under the back door. Oh, boy. It's going to take a miracle to get me out of this one. <laughs> oh, Mr. Egan! I thought somebody was going to meet me. Well, I, uh, I, uh... I waited and waited and waited at that airport for three quarters of an hour. I, uh, I... I finally took a cab. And when I got to the meeting, you'd all left. I... <laughs> now, let me tell you, Baxter, if you've let this deal fall through on us, I'm getting myself another boy. I... Hi, Mr. Egan. Hello, Hazel. I'm sorry I got everything snarled up not meeting you at the airport, but it's lucky I didn't. Right, Mr. B? Lucky? Sure. You wouldn't want to sign with them other people when you got the Muller Bake Shop. Here's that power of attorney you've been waiting for, Mr. B. Why, this is wonderful news, George. <laughs> I'm sorry if I seemed a trifle upset. You better look it over, see it's okay. How did you ever convince Muller that he ought to sell? Well, when Mr. Muller decided his wife wasn't going to change her mind, he finally realized that he had to change his, so he packed up and went off to California. <laughs> right? Yes, I, I, I guess that's about what happened. Uh, well, anyway, here's the power of attorney permitting me to transfer the property over to you at the terms we agreed upon. Yeah, and probably signed by both partners, you see? <laughs> Dinner's going to be a little late, Mr. Egan. Why don't you and Mr. B go into the living room and I'll whip you up some of them little cheese puffs you like. Hazel, are those contour shoes that you're wearing? Yeah, they ain't much on looks, but boy, are they comfortable. So I've heard. I'd like to try a pair. Well, I'll take you down to Senior Antonio's tomorrow. He's a real artist. Oh, that's very kind of you, Hazel. Oh, no trouble. I was going there anyway. I'm going to order me a parent white kid to go with my summer uniforms. I'd sure appreciate it. Oh, well, they're pretty expensive, but they're worth every penny of it. I feel I can afford them now since I made that terrific investment last week. A hundred percent on my money. <laughs>
Screen Gems production.